Hi, Hiram here. Gonna try a little video. I put 30 milliliters or about one fluid ounce of methanol in the Vargo converter, Vargo titanium converter stove. It's only like half full. So let's see what happens with this when we try to light it. See how long it takes, if ever, to come to a bloom. Of course, I'm gonna speed this up. Okay, we've got to be over 20 minutes. I didn't set a timer, but look in the upper right hand corner and you'll see the real elapsed time. But I figure this must, this has got to be over 20 minutes and it's just barely coming up the tube in the middle. I want to see something here. Yep, it's warm, but it's not hot. I don't know. This Vargo stuff, maybe you can't see that. This Vargo stuff looks nice. I mean, you know, I've had some of these other Vargo stoves. They look really cool, but just don't do too good for light. Oh, there we go. Uh, almost. Just don't do real good for lighting. So, I don't know. Okay, so that's like over 20 minutes. And you can see where the flame looks like it's trying to get up. I think if there were vapors coming out of these jets, it would light it. That's my breath pushing the flame away. Not saying that I got strong breath, just the breeze. See, even with doing that, it's not lighting it. Okay, I have a couple of other ideas. Maybe a piece of rolled up carbon felt going down the chute. There's been a number of people asking me, is there a liner in this? In the bottom of the tube are two slots and I've stuck a, a, real, a real fine copper wire in there and I don't see and I don't feel anything. So I have the feeling that this thing is just a hollow tube. How they expect that to come to a light, I don't know. That means this whole chamber has to fill up with vapors before it'll be forced out of the top. Crazy. Okay. See you in the next video. I thank you for watching. I look forward to your input, questions, remarks, helpful suggestions. And as always, watch for my buddy Max. Bye now.